And the Hawks with possession here. It's a three-point game. Jackson with it. Here's the pass to Elijah Wan. On the wing, Jackson. Shot clock at five. There's the dish to Malone. Over Purdue. And the basket by Malone. Malone's got 35 in the game. Boy, I tell you what, Malone, an excellent pick and roll threat. And a knockdown shooter, too, which makes him hard to guard. Master Wilkins. Smith on the wing. Purdue with a screen on Ainge. Smith with it, picked up by Elijah Wan. Here's Purdue. Good D by Elijah Wan. Well, he's much better than that. Really no excuse for missing that lane. Here's Pippen. Sinks it from just inside the baseline. Pippen's got four points in the quarter. That is the sweet spot for Scotty. That mid-range game. Skiles the pass to Harper. Wilkins with it. Purdue with a screen on Malone. Down low. Gets it to go. That one good from Purdue. And this is how you capitalize down the stretch. I mean, the coaching staff has got to be pleased with that. And the game isn't over yet, but that was huge. Let's see if they're able to close it out. Now here's Pippen. Malone in the corner. Rebound, Harper. That's normally one of his spots. It was a quality look. Shade to see it go to waste. And it's Wilkins finishing it off. They knew who to go to in the big moment. Wilkins is a trusted scorer on this spot. Jackson kicks to Elijah on. Here's Malone. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Malone's got 37. No doubt about it. That's a big shot. Huge from Carl Malone. He's definitely a go-to guy in this league. Time call here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. Teams changing it up here. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldrich. David? Hey, guys. Well, the Hawks coach had some words for his team during the last time out. Now he's encouraging them to keep attacking in the paint. He said, when we get inside, we score. Simple as that. Keep attacking and don't settle for anything that's not at the rim. Kevin, back to you. Okay, David, much appreciated. Here is Purdue. Smith on the wing, guarded by Jackson. Charity stripe shot. Good work there as it goes. That gives him the double-double. 10 points and 11 assists. Showing some gumption on that shot. Smith comes up with some needed points. Here's Elijah Wong. The layup off target. The Hogs trail by three. Here's Curry in Atlanta again with the bucket. Boy, got a pretty good look at it and makes the most of it. But I put that one on the defense. They can't be leaving him open at this stage. Now here's Jackson. Shoots a fader. Oh, they get it back. The shot's good from Jordan. How about that intensity that Jordan brings? I mean, this dude comes alive during crucial parts of the game. Here's Wilkins. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. One on Pippen. You know, I think that was a message-sending foul there. They're not going to allow any easy buckets at the rim. Yeah, as a coach, I like that one. Make them earn it at the line. He hits the first one, and that brings them within two. And this team wants Wilkins on the line. They believe in his ability to come up clutch for them. Throws good from Wilkins. This is what makes him special, his ability to come through in these spots. Outside Jordan. 
Jones as it come along. Mills with the rebound. Mills has got 11 rebounds in the game. Smith, the pass to Wilkins. Shoots over Pippen. Wilkins' shot is off. And this is how you defend a player like him. Nice job contesting without foul. And a wide open look for Jordan. The shot's good on the assist by Pippen. And the Knicks lead by three. He's such a clutch shooter. He just lives for the big shot. Wilkins kicks to Smith. Back to Wilkins. Nice ball movement here by Atlanta. Outside curve. In the corner, Wilkins with it. And it's out of bounds. The Knicks will take it the other way. And wow, what a time for a turnover. Shows you just how key a play like this can be. There's 53 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. On the wing, Malone. Back to Jackson. Releases. Rebounded by the Hawks. Smith surveying the D. Money! Calm, collected, and composed. Nicely done. Yes, he coolly got that one to drop under pressure. So everything Mike has led to this. Time for your leaders to step up. On the wing, Malone. Back to Jackson. Let's it go with a three. Kept alive by New York, and he commits the intentional foul. Yeah, that's a good play. I mean, fouling there in hopes of staying alive in this one, that's the right play. They need every second they can get at this point. Do whatever they can to come back. and that will put them up by two. Well, the entire team is counting on Malone here. They seem confident that he'll be able to deliver. And so both free throws are good. It's a three-point game. And they needed those free throws right here. At worst, the opposition ties it with a three now. Time called here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. They're behind by three. 15 seconds left in the game. Guys, what do you think? I think if they leave the three-point shot open, you take it. But it may be safer and wiser to get a quick two and then foul. Well put. But they shouldn't force something up here. They have to be smart. seconds left to play here in the fourth. Pass to Purdue. Smith outside. Off target from downtown. And the shooter had really no airspace to get that shot off. That's good D. Yeah, terrific defense. Doing a great job contesting without foul. Gives them a four-point cushion. Oh. 
so he gets them both, and it's a five-point game. Unflappable. This guy relishes being the man to put the game away. Time call here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. They're down by five. Five seconds left to play in the final quarter. Guys, your thoughts? Hey, it's pretty simple, if we're honest. Tonight, they just weren't good enough. At this point, you start thinking of next game, because this one is finished. Get it to fall. And they do it. They'll move on That's to round two. NBA. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinals. For our terrific reporter David Aldridge, along with Clark Kellogg and Mike Fratello, I'm Kevin Harlan saying thank you for tuning in tonight. So long, everyone. Yeah.